Hey guys, welcome to Franklin Woodworks. I've had a few guys ask me about my shop air cleaner, so I thought I'd do a quick video explaining how it works and how I put it together. First off, I wanted it to be cheap. Cheap to make and cheap to maintain. I'd seen many designs where guys use squirrel cage fans, but I couldn't find one for cheap, so I opted to go with a simple 20 inch box fan. As it turns out, not only is this a pretty effective route to go, it makes the build very simple and cheap. Since the fan is a 20 inch box, I wanted to use 20 by 20 filters. I went to Home Depot and bought a pack of the cheapest filters they had, which is a pack of four for less than $4. And the filters are about three quarters of an inch thick. The box is made of plywood and is 22 by an eighth inch square and it's 20 inches deep. The grooves for the filters are one inch and I made the grooves by just tacking in plywood strips. The groove for the fan is just wide enough to accommodate the fan and as you can see I took off the grills on the front and back. Access to the filters is by a door mounted in place with a piano hinge. A cabinet door magnet keeps the door closed. When I took these pictures, I did not clean out the inside. This is how it looks after nearly a year of use. I think the filters are doing a pretty good job of getting the bigger particles. After doing a little research, I found that the filters are rated at 10 microns, so I'm sure a lot of bad stuff is still getting through. As soon as I get this video posted, I plan to go to Home Depot and buy a good filter as the last filter in the chain. That way the cheap filters will get the big stuff and hopefully the expensive filter will last a lot longer. I took the switch off the fan so I could mount it on the underside of the box. This allows me to change the speeds if I need to. But I bought a cheap remote switch so I can turn it on and off from anywhere in the shop. So that's my air cleaner. I'd love for you to give the video a thumbs up and please subscribe if you haven't already. Hope you all have a good week, and there you go.